Welcome to the Wolfenstein 3D walkthrough on the I Am Death Incarnate difficulty for the PC. I'm Jefferson Davis, and this is Episode 5, Floor 6. Okay, turn to the right and then destroy the enemies to the right as best as you can and as fast as you can, because there are a few enemies and the area is pretty wide open. Now these officers actually came from this door right here, and more can come from there, so be careful of that. And some guards can come from this door, so be careful of that. And there's a guard at the end of this hall, so deal with him. Then go back the way you came, and look! An officer. Yes, an officer was following us. Not good. Not good at all. If you need some patching up, there's a med pack behind these green barrels here. Now go back and face the start door, then go around the island it's on, straight forward to this door. Eyes forward, mate. There's a couple of SS in this room, but nothing major. And there's a gold door, but we can't open it yet, so go back and face the door you used to get to this room. Then turn left, and on the left-hand wall, right here, is a secret room. Inside is a wide variety of items, so grab everything you may need, and I mean there's a lot of things. It's a stock room. No, not Facebook stock. Ammo stock. And uh, as we come... Oh, okay. Well, that's convenient. Now we're going to want to go all the way around this crescent-shaped hallway, all the way to the end of it. Yeah, it's a long journey. At the end is the gold door, another gold door, but we can't open it yet. Go and face the first door you come to on the left. And uh, what? Oh, okay. Now there's usually a second guard that comes with him, but in this case, I don't see him. But anyway, face the door, then turn right, and to the right of these jutting out walls is a secret room. And... dead. Now in this final secret room, that's right, final, there's only two of them, and uh, they come relatively early. Very reminiscent of the previous secret room, there's a lot of items in here, so grab everything you need. And then open up the door that the guards came from. And then go down the hallway to the left. Now depending on how many you killed in, you know, that came for you out of those, out of that door, there will be either one to three guards in this room, so deal with them as best you can. In this case, only one. Uno. Now in here, there's three doors we can open. One with Nazi flags, one that has a blank flank, and one with eagle portraits. Open up the eagle portrait one. Pay attention to this gold door. It'll be the first gold door we come to and open, so remember where it is. This door just takes us back out to the start room. Go back through the door and open up the blank one now. The blank door. Now in here, just head right. And I apologize if my voice sounds a little bit different in this playthrough. Um, I just woke up, and uh, whenever I wake up, my voice sounds really super terra bad. So now we'll go left down this hallway. Very reminiscent of the previous room you were just at. There are some enemies, and some items. And he, I think he shot me through the wall. What a cheater. Oh well. By the way, this door right here just takes you back to the start room. Convenient. And hello there, Mr. Guard. You're dead now. Open up this door with the red knots and flags and kill the enemies, who are worthless with their backs turned toward you. Another gold door, but, uh, you know, we can't open it yet. We have the absence of a gold key, but not for long. Go down this hallway to retrieve the gold key, but not without first slaying some foes. And there are a few of them, so deal with them as best you can. The gold key is your reward. But instead of opening up that gold door that's in this room, we'll go back to that gold door I said to remember. Which is through here, through the door across from you, and right here. Whoa! Ah! Uh, Apparently there's not as many corners as I thought there were, but uh, deal with those enemies. There's the silver key, 
as our reward. Now we'll go back to that uh, last gold door we were at. And there it is. Go through it. Now this room is empty, so just grab the treasure. It's all yours. Now there's a gold door to the left and right, and uh, both will take you back to the start room, or close to the start room. And if you want extra ammo, the secret rooms are right next to it. Open up the uh, silver door now. Deal with this first SS, then take position around this corner as a hold point, and wait for the three SS officers to come for you. If they would come one at a time, that would be wonderful, but they didn't. Anyway, you can take care of the rest of the enemies in this map one at a time. Peek around this corner. Peekaboo, I see you! Alright, but there is one more enemy, and he's behind the exit door. So I'm just going to grab the extra ammo here, and uh, grab the treasure. And then, yeah, we're done. And one thing I didn't show off or mention is that uh, if you need extra ammunition, you can go back and exit the silver door and take either the left or right gold door, and outside the gold doors are the secret rooms. And you see, I, I have 71 ammo, so if you need, you know, if you want to be boosted back to maximum, just go back to those secrets, because there's lots of ammunition inside. But anyway, because I want to keep this walkthrough short so I didn't show that off, but you can do that. Anyway, about this map. This map is uh, not that hard. The only tough spots are really the, the, the start. Um, the fact that the guards can come from the central island outside the doors and mow you down, well not mow you down, but shoot you, you know, can be a little challenging. The gold and silver keys are relatively protected, but it's not that hard if you just, you know, keep your finger on the trigger and just fire. So that's the end of Floor 6. Not at all that difficult of a map, pretty small. I'll see you in Floor 7, everybody. We're getting close to the end of Episode 5. But until then, I'm Jefferson Davis.